Ryan Dungey closing the gap back up on a Michael Essie when we went away to break. Dungey made a mistake, hit a bump that knocked him off the track, and he is clawing his way back into this one. So for the second time, Dungey is having to make up some ground on Alessi. Alessi's been pretty solid, actually, there. You see the lap time trend. It's just that Dungey, when he has a clean lap, just able to go a little bit quicker. Dungey's got that loose but fast thing going right now. You see the back wheel of KTM kicking out a little bit here and there. Uh, even on the lap that he made the mistake, he still turned a 240. So he made a big mistake, went off the track, and then the next three quarters of a lap, totally put the hammer down and uh, matched his lap time, basically. So the race is on once again for this moto win between Michael Lessie and Ryan Dungey. Yeah, so we can bench race and you know, Talk about scenarios all we want. There you see Dungey at one point putting down a 236, where Alessi only with a best of 239 during that span. We could talk about the scenario of the titles wrapped up and who's motivated based on what, but really it comes down to this. These guys are racers, and they both want to win. Doesn't matter where they are in points, what date it is on the calendar, what state the racetrack is built in. They just want to get to that checkered flag first. So we're going to see a real battle here for the win at Steel City. Well, and it looks like Alessi's got some pretty good lines. I mean, his pace isn't, I mean, isn't that much slower, maybe just a little bit. But what's going to happen is now once Ryan Dungey closes up, right here, Alessi's going to hear the crowd start to get into it. When you're out front and you start to hear the crowd, that means somebody's probably reeled in behind you. Plus, he's going to hear Dungey's bike. So the best thing that Alessi can do to try to hold the lead is put the blinders on, focus on what he is doing, focus on hitting every turn perfectly, not making any mistakes, and riding the very best that he can. Well, unless he's darn good at that, he gets such good starts, he knows how to ride his line, not be affected by the pressure behind him. And I gotta say this year, there have been some moments maybe where Alessi is throwing in a brake check here or there, but for the most part, he's just riding his line. It's not full on cutting off and blocking. Yeah, is it? His pace has been good, and that's a maturity thing uh, with uh, Michael Lessie here, and he's shown a lot of respect uh, for Ryan Dungey this season. But also, within that, he's still, you know, he's out there. He's trying to beat him, and he seems to be the one guy that uh, that really has the speed consistently. Of course, Tyler Rattray won the Moto2 at Southwick, an incredible ride uh, for Tyler, but his starts um, here today have just really set him back as Rattray is back at 12th as we speak. Now remember, Dungey does not need to make this pass to win the overall for the weekend. He has it because he had a win in Moto 1. He'd have a second here, so that's a first and a second. Or Alessi had a third in the first Moto. You see, when you total up the points, Alessi is going to be two points short of the overall win today. But you mentioned Rattray getting that Moto win at Southwick, and that was crazy circumstances for Dungey. Dungey crashed. Then the fuel cap was knocked loose in the bike, and Dungey had to pit to refill the fuel tank. He still finished second at the moto, which was phenomenal to finish second considering that. And I think he was still mad that he didn't get the win. Dungey just wants to win every darn moto he's in. So he's not going to be happy to just get the overall. He wants to make the pass on Alessi. And Alessi, of course, wants to hold him off. Well, these riders, they work so hard. They're, they dedicate their life to the sport of motocross. The training, uh, very physical. There's a lot of pain uh, involved with that. And putting yourself uh, or getting yourself to this level. But, I mean, think about it, Ryan Dungey, he's been on the podium every moto this year. That's every unbelievable. Moto. That's uh, unbelievable. That's consistently great. And Dungey now going to work the inside on Alessi. And Alessi, that outside line pays off. It's the inside to the next corner. Another Ooh. big mistake from Dungey. And that allows Alessi to open it up a bit again. Dungey's trying pretty hard right now. I think that the, the difference is, well, the race at Washougal, where Michael Lessie won, Dungey was trying hard too, and he made some mistakes in the process, but also it tells you that Dungey, uh, even though he's been great all season long, he still knows that Michael Lessie, in the right opportunity, has the talent, has the speed, has the ability to go out and win that moto. Dungey having a little bit of problem with the lap riders right there too. You see him just, he's loose, and he's making a lot of mistakes right now, and he's dropped back just a little bit. But think about that, a couple of mistakes, and he's still only a couple bike links off of Alessi. Dungey is really putting in a strong ride around, and he's trying hard. 